Well, well professional. professional. Yeah, yeah. It's a professional it's a, news organization. Yeah, yeah. This is what it's got to be done. This is serious journalism. Yeah. Reporting for the BBC in Wem. <laughs> <laughs> I am with BBC Ariel Shrop- Salad. BBC Shropshire. I'm with a couple of guys whose album covers have ranged with cockroaches. That's the one, yeah. yeah. Uh, Oh, you fucking drew it, didn't you, Mike? Yeah, um, it's just, I can't draw, I don't do art, but everyone's like, oh, it's really good, I'm like, I can just draw it with a sharpie. It's just a spliff with legs, just, isn't it? Yeah, That's just, what you said. You know what, it's just funny, like, and it's, <laughs> it's, it's true. It's got the antenna. Yeah. It's just stupid, isn't it? It's like, you don't, <laughs> it's like an HMV next to Abba and Aerosmith, and it's just a fucking, it's just a drawing Mike's done on his own. Like. Yeah. Well, Why not, you know, you wonk unit. Oh, you guys have an association with them. Alex draws everything himself. So, yeah. you guys, yeah. you're right along. Had, it was him who said we had to do it. He, he was like, because I said about getting someone I knew that did art to do it. I was going to get uh, Dan Allen to do it, actually. But then Alex was like, no, 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 it's got to be you guys. And I was like, well, it's probably would have looked a bit better. But it's yeah. good we've done it in the end. It's our, like, Misfits oh, yeah, yeah. logo, isn't it? You'll see that in Top Man in 25 it's years, like our hopefully. Milo as well. Exactly. You're going to have teeny boppers that have no idea who you are. Wearing your cockroach. I know, I can't wait I can't wait for the official aerial salad Mike Wimbledon bobblehead, which will be available at our band camp soon. Go like Ra- Ralph Lauren, go out get polo shirts. <laughs> sell, sell them to the Tories, they love that. Just sell little, out. Little cockroaches. <laughs> Even I would get that. Although right now you've got one, is very tempting, your Bobby Hill shirt. Oh yeah, the oh, Bobby yeah, Hill. Yeah, yeah. Well, it's just funny. Um, the, whole, the whole idea kind of got out of hand. I was just I was just getting stone watching King of the Hill and I was having a great time and I was watching that episode. I was like, I bet I could get my mate to sort of edit, uh, leave me alone onto this. And then I got my mate to make the shirt as well and I just thought, you know what, sack it. It's well funny though, it's ridiculous. Oh, remember, remember I saw that and went, yes, writing? yes. I thought yeah. that was pretty funny, like that unreadable like pirate font. It's, it's <laughs> well the after. black metal. You've yeah. got the black metal logo thing going. I was thinking going. more San Andreas. I was thinking more Grand Theft Auto. I was thinking, of, I was thinking yeah. of keeping it, keeping it West Coast, keeping it LA. We like, we do like to keep it on the LA. The old Julio. <laughs> LL Cool J. That's the one. That's the one. All, 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 all the, the, the no, rap. LL Cool J wasn't from uh, LA, was he? Probably. Yes, he was. was he was from LA. Yes. The L L actually stands for Los Angeles somewhere. Um, yeah. It doesn't. No, you just made that up. That's an absolute right. fabrication. That. I'll, I'll Google it. Don't do this because no, it's going to be like the Primarchs. <laughs> 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 do you know how many Primarchs there are in England? Do I know Primark in England? No, yes. Do you, know, do you know how many there are? How many stores? Oh, how many? Uh, well, right. Yeah. You know, there's some things, there's some facts you're told that you're sure about. So in the UK, there's a three to one ratio. There's there's three more subways in everywhere than there are Mackies. It's like three to one. That would turn out to be a fact. We googled that. That was true. But for some odd reason, I didn't. My head. There was only 22 Primarks in the UK, yeah, and I was adamant. Yeah. Turns out it was like 300. So I, you know, Primarks put me over. You know, as it does sort of, you know, children around the world because you know it's you know it's slave labour, isn't it, Primark? So message from Ariel Salad. You know, buy ethical, buy, buy right, buy our stuff. Ours is Gildan though, so we're being yeah. a bit hypocritical here. And is Gildan all right? I don't know. You know, I'm not sure. I mean, it's Tommy from One Unit who presses it, and I know he's paid quite well. I know he's blame him. Yeah, he, yeah, blame Tommy. Him, blame Tommy. Your yeah. Tommy. It's your fault. <laughs> now you guys just released a video, and I need to know who christened the pool. When you say christened, what do you mean? Who was the first to get in it? Is it the first one to do a wee in it? Because that was Jamie. Yes. Yeah, it was Jamie. I did a wee in the pool. Yeah. Um, it, Alex went happy about that. It's not a real pool. I, know, I didn't song. do. Oh shit, no, because I didn't actually do a wee in the pool. I didn't do. Alex, is he lying? He's lying. I did, yeah, I did do a little wee in the pool actually. It was a bit, but it was one of them, you know. I was so, I was so overcome with emotion and joy. I was just having the funniest day of my life. I literally pissed myself with excitement. So that's it. You couldn't help it. It, it just was all of the jumping in the Such pool. Energy. Yeah. Athleticism. Do you know what we were? We were rambunctious, yeah. weren't we? We were, we were being raunchy young men. In a in a pool. You were. You were. You were. Yeah, just a just a couple just a couple of cuties having a day in the swimming pool. But it's very serious though. It's a very serious yeah, music yeah. video. There's a deep underlining sort of pain and angst within it, isn't there? Isn't the Michael? Because I remember you were really intent on going 
you know, you were like, oh, the deep message. Were, what was the yeah. deep message that, that the video says to people, Michael? Because that's your, that's your sort of... Um, your, you were the visionary, if you will, behind that. Yeah, I was the, uh, the, the Tarantino or <laughs> the Stanley Kubrick behind it. It was a long thought process. And it took us a year to decide what it was going to do. But in the end, we and didn't. then you just did a bunch of belly flops. You know what? It, it hurt as well. Right? He's the man who actually came up with the idea. We're just na- he just wanted oh, he just wanted to see two naked children in his swim pool. It's not as well. it's not for skateboarding and it's for it's for you know getting getting his young lovers down. <laughs> hello boys. Hi, hi, hi punk rockers. <laughs> hello Alex. Hi guys. <laughs> hello. Did you know he was the one to christen your skate no, pool? Thing. Yeah, that, I hope they've been behaving. I hope they haven't been spreading hate on the main streets of Wem today. You go watch these youngsters. There's, there's a new dangerous element that's entered the punk rock scene, and it's called Fun. smiley faces Look and happiness that. and positivity. Yeah, loving each well other. Done. Doing the mo- doing the most we can. Just you know, have a. Uh, do you know what? Like we're very serious musicians, really, aren't we? Deep down, but it's more important to have fun. And be serious. That's don't be JME. That song's shit. <laughs> Who's gonna sign a guy with a shank? A guy with nine mil. Terrible. I'm not calling you out, Jamie. Obviously, you could probably hurt me quite a lot. You and your, and your boys. <laughs> Boy, better know crew. They probably sort us out. I had nothing to do with that. <laughs> We're so dashing, aren't we? <laughs> <laughs> and now that you've been tweaked by Godfather Wonk. Yeah. Is there anything else you guys would like to let the world know about? Um. I, no. I'd actually like people to know about social... I know what's it called. Date, date a waste, right? My mate Amelia was telling me about this. When it? you send loads of emails, it creates like data waste. And it fucking... It, because it's got to be stored using electricity. Apparently it's well bad for the environment and there's nothing we can do about it. So... Fucking data waste, you know. Delete. I think deleting your emails is good, but I don't really know too much about it. But that, I think, I feel like that's very important. I feel like more people should discuss this. That was your moment. I, you know what? I've, I can one up you there. Go on, Have you ever tried doing the washing up without any washing up liquid? <laughs> 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 where, are you, where are you going? <laughs> I don't know. Um, just don't. Uh, what do you ma- use instead? Um, just hot water. <laughs> I think the message to the whoever the punk rock world is: <laughs> be all right, don't be a prick, and love each other. Yeah, mom. I agree with that, and don't eat anything off the plates in his house. He doesn't use any washing up liquid. You know what? You're all wrong. Use paper plates. It's good, <laughs> it's good for the environment. I totally agree with that one. Yeah. Paper plates for everyone. Salford Dining, Jabless. That's it. Jabless. <laughs> nice one, cheers. Right, we got to go have a. Uh, Thank you, guys. Something. We will see you on stage in a few. Nice, nice one. Cheers. Thank you. Thanks.